Hey, that's the culprit. We've got a pressure relief valve on the water heater that is letting the water blow by. My water bill was up. My gas bill was up. Makes me wonder. So we take a look at it. So on the water heater, the cold water comes in at the bottom here, warms it up, and then the hot water comes out here. And then every water heater has a safety relief valve, high pressure, high temperature valve. Mine's blowing by. So we've got water going by that and going underneath the house, making a puddle, not good. Here's the crawl space. And let's see what we can find. Way back in the corner there. You can actually, looks like a steady run. And look at this, there's a puddle right there. Not and good. Just what we need, water shut off, right here. Let's start the repair. We start by hooking a hose on to the drain and open this up and start drawing some water out of here. That's gonna jump out over here. Now that we're draining, we're gonna take off the overflow pipe. Once that's off, well, we can hear the gurgle. That means that we're still pulling air up here as it drains down at the bottom. Let's see if we can start to loosen this up. Yeah. Throw a big wrench on it. And spin it. Now we can spin this out of here. Ooh, baby, look at the corrosion on that. I wonder why it wasn't sealing well. Welcome to Home Depot. There we go. That's the fix. We've got three good wraps of Teflon tape on the valve. Slide it in here. Put a wrench and we'll tighten that up. Now that we've got it tight, we can hook the drain line back up. No sealant required on that. Come on, baby, start in there. There you go. And uh, let's turn the water on. Turn the water back on. And we're filling the water tank back up. And we can hear it filling up. Coming right in here. There we go. I always like to run hot water. To start with blow the air out. Oh, here we are, successful pressure relief valve change out. The water heater's getting warm again. So, hey, keep it right side up.